Well, hey, this is Hans the Ramen Raider coming at with you. Oh, coming at you with another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time, the show where I show you what to do with your instant noodles. And uh, Kazoo, how's it going? So, uh, yeah. Today I dropped my bottom 10 instant noodles of all time, but that's not what we're talking about today. But if you want to check it out, go to theramenraider.com and look at the top 10s and you'll see in there is the bottom 10s too. We got one that came out of a Zenpop box today. Go to zenpop.jp, use the coupon code theramenraider for a discount. This is, I've got my handy info sheet. This is Ace Cook. Mochi Mugi Yuzu Kosho Chicken Flavor. And let's see. Let me let me get it in to go. Uh, butchered the pot or the bowl, but you know. You know what I do. I just use the pot instead of the bowl. It's really not that hard to do. Not a crazy stretch. Oh my. Oh. Scissors. Okay, we got scissors. Let's get this sucker going and I'll yammer with you about all sorts of weird stuff. I don't know if you've noticed, if you're a longtime listener to the show, like all of this last year, you might notice something going on here that's a little different. I've changed the music, ladies and gentlemen. Finally. I've gotten new music. I've just been like really, really derelict in duty on doing that, but we are getting new music now. There we go. That stuff's gone. Put that lid on top. But yeah, new tunes, all of it's new. So these uh, come from Epidemic Sound. If you go to their website, you can get a monthly deal and get all sorts of music for your videos too. But uh, yeah, what does this say? It takes five minutes. I started the timer here. The f this fiber rich. Oh, the fiber-rich mochi mugi pearl barley noodles make for a hearty and satisfying bowl of deliciously chewy noodles. The mellow Japanese-style chicken-based soup is accented with yuzu koshu, kosho, a Japanese citrus, and spicy pepper to enhance the flavor. A cup of pleasures ready in five minutes. We'll see. I'm not. I'm not real partial on yuzu. We'll see. I'll give it a chance. And now it's time for our quote of the day from Momofuku Ando speaks. These are quotes by the guy who invented instant noodles. Wow, these are long quotes too. Uh... I think we're on 271. Compared to beef or pork, chicken has fine fibers and is easy to digest. It tastes it tastes lighter and leaner as well. Grilling chicken along with aromatic ingredients such as sesame oil, ginger, shiitake mushrooms, and sake lessens the smell of the meat and brings out the flavor. Okay. So yeah, there is that. Chicken. Chicken like it. So I did a whole bunch of video editing this weekend. Last week I did a whole bunch of walking and not a lot of reviews. Uh, it's, it's late April now. What is it? The 26th? So I've been doing a whole bunch of that stuff and uh, yeah. Got a bunch and got more noodles coming and more noodles and more noodles more noodles it's just non-stop right now which is really helpful because i'm kind of low on varieties to review but uh i've got three i'm doing today it's already noon i got an hour and a half left to do these 
It's a little loud. Let me turn it down a bit. Shush! It's been a noisy kid day. Officially, way too noisy kid day. Let's see. A little stir. Miles! Stop bugging your sister. Mimi, stop bugging your brother. That's what it's been like all day. They've just been really cranky with each other. It's been irritating. But she said I can't kill them, so I'm not gonna. Speaking of killing, uh, my buddy Matt B came out with his book. It's on Amazon right now. What is it? bit.ly slash letters from jet uh it's a book about the correspondence he had with a serial killer so if you want to check that out you should do so uh he's sending a copy and we're gonna do a kind of like a little interview about it so he's doing a uh what do you call it and ask me anything an ama on reddit tomorrow Oh, jeepers. And, uh, yeah, so that'll be pretty cool. Hopefully a lot of people are into it. And, uh, what else is going on? I'm trying to get, like, three reviews done every day this week. Maybe not on Wednesday. Wednesday I can get a lot of steps in. But, yeah, I was really slack Saturday and Sunday. Really slack. But in the seven days before Saturday, I think I got like 120 miles in walking. So that's a lot. I already got like 12 today. I don't know. All right. So this is finished. It's a new term. Finished. So here is our Yuzu Shio Ramen with pearl bar. I really like mochi mugu. I, I know exactly what that is. I when I started all my diet stuff, I ate that like every month or every every night, mixed into a can of Progresso soup. Worked really well. Lots of fiber. Good for the pooping. <laughs> Hmm, I'm getting kind of a smoky scent. We'll see how this goes. I like the noodle. Good chew on it. Chewy. There's the bra. I think I'm getting a hint of the yuzu, but it's kind of hard to tell. It's not strong, which is not a bad thing. I don't really. Yeah. And as far as having a spicy element to it, I'm not getting that either, but I like it. I am not complaining about this noodle. I could if I wanted to, but I just don't want to because I don't, I, I, I like it, okay? I think it's good. Come on, bits in the bottom. You don't get to live there anymore. Get out of there! Get out of there! No, no, get out of there. Alright. What are we gonna do to this? Well, since it's Shio, um, I'm gonna add some Shilkin. Chicken goes well with Shio. Or, 
got some extra. Mmm. That's yummy. I make some good chicken, folks. Yeah, I'm tooting my horn. Now time for a holy egg. <laughs> it's new music, Mimi. I believe it's the sound of Tamil Urdu. Still haven't gotten a new knife yet. This knife. Yeah, when you slice up, when you slice up as many eggs as I do, you learn the fact that when you try to run them through the dishwasher after doing so, if you don't clean them first, all that egg glue will goo will stick. And nobody wants sticky egg goo. Oh, maybe you might. Do you like the sticky egg goo? You do? Well, what's wrong with you? There's something wrong with you. I mean, at least sticking to your, uh, your cutlery. I want to take that out of the dishwasher and have egg goo still stuck to it. That's nasty. Not fun. Yeah, that might have been a mistake. I don't know, we'll see. And we're going to go with one small. Bit of happiness. Ain't your lunch, Miriam. See, I told her. Didn't I? Where'd that go? Where'd it go? There it is. Look at that. Fancy. Is this Shichimi from, uh... Something from Nissan for their 50th anniversary. And I found something better to put it in than a little can I had. I put a little sesame seed on it. Eat your lunch! Go, go! Alright. Yeah, this is a yummy one. I really did not expect to like this, but you know what? I am pleasantly surprised. Which is pleasant. You know, these days, ladies and gentlemen, we need as much pleasant thing stuff as possible. Oh, did they switch to the cooking show, Mimi? God, I hate cooking shows, too. Oh, come on. There you go. All right, new tunes. from Takamori. This is their Japanese Karako Spaghetti. Spaghetti! So, uh, yeah, you can enjoy that. You will. It's been hot 
is the Ramenator wishing you enjoyment of your noodles each and every day. Have a good one and bye.